All right, here we are in the middle of late May and snow continues to fall in the Sierra. While the timing may be a bit strange, this new this new snow does little to help with the drought. Our meteorologist Mark Tamayo is here checking in on a critical reservoir mark that much of the Bay Area depends on. That's right, Heather. We are talking about Hetch Hetchy, which is fed by a Sierra snowpack in the mountains in Yosemite National Park. But as drought conditions deepen over the entire state, the big snowpack we depend on never materialized. The Sierra snowpack is vanishing quickly, a dismal 2 to 5% of normal for May. The melting snow is a crucial resource that bolsters water supply. One reservoir that is watched closely is in Yosemite National Park. 85% of the water supply for parts of the Bay Area is linked to Hetch Hetchy. We serve 2.8 million customers uh, throughout the Bay Area. It's kind of service area is kind of a big fish hook running around from San Francisco down the peninsula, around the south end of the Bay, and up to Hayward in the East Bay. Steve Ritchie is the Assistant General Manager for Water at the San Francisco Public Utilities Commission. We explored the reservoir six years ago during our last drought. At first glance, the water reserves seem to be healthy, but far from normal. Fast forward to May 2021. You may expect extremely low levels. That is not the case. Current water supply is 93 billion gallons and continues to rise. The outlook calls for water storage that will approach 117 billion gallons, which is full capacity. When I read the headlines that the snowpack is wiped out, well, that's not totally true for us. We still have some snow melt to occur, again, because we have such a high watershed. What is normal during a normal year? Enough water should flow into this reservoir to fill it three times. While we are falling far short this year, supply will meet demand for Hetch Hetchy customers. So we want to make sure that uh, we don't put out some harsh rationing restrictions right now because we do have a good amount of water, not a great amount of water, but a good amount of water uh, because we don't want to uh, do anything to harm uh, economic recovery. Right now, there are calls for voluntary reductions for the 1,600 irrigation customers in San Francisco. While this mainly affects parks and golf courses, tighter restrictions could be on the horizon if the drought continues. These are all getting people in the mood of starting to take measures, recognizing that this year is bad, but if next year is bad, then we will have to get serious about reductions in water use. And Hetch Hetchy will reach, as you heard, full capacity, but the same cannot be said about all the other reservoirs across the state and here in the, the Bay Area. So the key is with everybody, of course, we want to start thinking of ways to uh, conserve water and change our water use because, of course, we are in a drought and we have to assume that the drought will continue into next week, until we, into next year, I should say, because until we really get those storms uh, showing up, we are still in a drought, a worsening drought.